So UK says, I am using the AD Premium 2, but I have more staff that I'm willing to pay for. Uh, the main team of five, I can understand a whole public institution is just too much. I kind of add janitors and sales that will never use these services much. Must I use AD B2C? But the B2C is for customers, and I already have very many of them. What can I do? It is very expensive to host uh, 9,281 people in an AD Premium 2. Yeah, so my, my take on this, um, just trying to kind of eke out from the question, what he's trying to achieve. Obviously, he's talking about public institutions, he's talking about having a re relatively large user base, right? 9,281 people. Mm -hmm. The thing with Azure licenses, you don't you don't have to license every single person with the the highest level of license. Right? Not every single user must have a P2 license. You can you can blend and mix and match your licenses. So a little bit unsure. But I guess what he's trying to say is, as he says already, you know, we've got a team of five is admins. He can administer. He can have all those admins with P2s, uh, maybe a handful more with P2s. For regular users, he can use lower level licensing. Um, there is limitations to some of the mix and matching i'll put a link in the in the comments there as well christian if you can include that in the in the mm -hmm. the, the readout um if he so, wants to follow up it would help to understand what about p2 they need to use yeah so the key i mean the key the key features you get with p2 that over and above are the are the additional features around mfa right support for not just um like p1 only supports only supports authenticator app P2 provides you with access for telephone calls and SMS as well. There's additional features around it, and, and there's some other things as well. But yeah, I think the app proxy moved into P2 at one point. Yeah. So it's it's a it's a big landscape of change, but it's, it's a case of understanding what his minimum requirements are and what what are the requirements for the admins. With respect, his comment about Azure B B to C, if he's thinking about using B to C with this, you know, 9,000 of these people, that seems that seems like a whole different conversation. And I think these kind of going down that path with a view to seeing what lower level license he can use. Um, I just did a very quick exercise in building a blended cow type model with Azure and the Azure calculator can plan it out for you. Um, it only gives the prices obviously in, in regular retail prices, but there is links to talk to a special licensing specialist if you want to get some, I'm not sell, trying to sell anything here, but there's an option there in the calculator to find a licensing specialist to help you out. Dealer in the dark arts. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> True.